Hi everybody, this is Cass from Boom Gel Stain and this is actually a take two. That's why I've all of a sudden got a mess. Um, I don't normally start off messy, but I thought I had my white that I was laying down onto my canvas and it was actually my clear flow medium. So I just scraped it off. Um, okay, this is an 18 by 12 centimeter canvas. All I'm doing here is laying down a background layer of sterling wax white. Okay, I've got the edges pretty covered, I think. Oh, I can't believe I did that. Okay, so this is what I'm calling the abstract rose um, or swell technique. Now, all I'm going to do is put down some of my puddles. And I, for this, because I'm going to blow my puddles over each other, I do like to use different opacity colours. Um, now, we do have an opacity chart on the Facebook group Boom Gel Stain, um, and soon our bottles will have them on the labels, but at present that hasn't happened on all our labels as yet. So this is a translucent. Most of the pearlescents in our range are translucent. Um, this is Pandaria Pink. This one is um, our limited edition Dusty Rose. And this is Bungara Brown. You only need a very small amount of that. It tends to, a little goes a long way with that color. And then this is our Metallic Gold. Okay, I'm gonna put some of that down. Um, all right, so all I'm going to do is actually just blow out. So I'm going to pause it. So I'm just going to spread it around. Okay, so as you can see, I've just randomly blown that around. Um, it looks somewhat like a bloom, but um, I wasn't going for that in particular. It's just to get some, get the puddles layering across each other and just to spread it out a little bit. Now, I'm actually going to let that sit for five minutes and then I'm going to spin it. Um, so I won't record that section. So all I'm going to do is put it onto a Lazy Susan and stretch out the design. Okay, I'm back. So all I've done is stretched it out. I'll just bring you in for a close-up. Aren't those colours just divine together? Okay, so let's see, am I back to being semi-centred? So I've stretched that out. And then I just go and grab a trusty skewer, which it looks like, I've forgotten my trusty skewer, have I? Yes, I have, hang on. Okay, I'm back with my trusty skewer. Okay, so for those who've seen my previous ones, I start from the center of my swell and work my way out. So for this, I'm just trying to figure out which, oh, sorry, didn't mean to shake the table like that, which way I'm going to have this coming. Okay, so I'm going to start up here. I think I'm going to do three. Um, okay. So there's my one. And I'm using the flat end, you'll notice, because sometimes the pointy end actually gets caught in the canvas. Um, and also the end of a paintbrush is also really nice to work with. So I'll just do another little one here. Uh, I'm not centering these very well. 
I haven't got my glasses on. Um, and I'll do another little one around here just to bring this out like that. Now I need something over here. I can see that. So what I might actually do, and I'd like for this to come down. So I'm just going to get my little spatula and just bring some bits down or out. And then I can just level that back out. Um, so I'm looking at it. Oh, I'll add some photos in a way. Um, there's a little bubble, so I've got to pop that. Okay. Now we're running out of sunlight quickly. Um, what I'll do is I will put some photos up at the end of this video. Um, now, I'm done, except I'm going to try and work this little area out just a little bit, just to give it a bit of something to that side. But apart from that, I'm pretty happy. I'll just give you some... So once these are dried, those pearlescent colours, um, they that's when they take on that um, metallic sheen, that real poppy metallic power same as the gold so that'll just look insanely beautiful so there you go so the way I see it in my head uh, is like that okay there we go so really really simple anyone can do it so remember less is best especially when we're wanting to create that negative space and how easy and I've got all those colors laid on top of each other to create a really pretty result thank you for watching I hope you're all safe and well bye bye